Koi Larry appears to have targeted Chrissy and Rock in response to claims that Larry came after Rock's man. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown, if you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. It took us a minute to digest all the tea that was spilled when Blueface and Jade and Alexis sat down with Jason Lee for his podcast earlier this fall. The father of three used the opportunity to address rumors that he financially abused Chrissy and Rock, and he also admitted that he might have gotten some head from Megan the Stallion a few years ago. Blue's second baby mama's appearance on the same show, unsurprisingly, has given us even more details on not only their co-parenting drama, but also the baddies cast members' beef with others in the industry. According to what we know, Rock and Blick Blick hitmaker Koi Larry aren't on good terms. Things are so tense between the two women that Lee received some backlash from the Boston native for interviewing her, which the 23-year-old pondered. Because I'm genuine, I thought she wanted to do a collab with some music. Chrysian recalled of her time previously spent with Larry. Out me out the plan and bag my nigga in some more shit. The reality starlet alleged. Now that she's been trolled about the confession by Rock's fans on social media, Larry took to Twitter on Friday afternoon to address the situation. Don't believe the cap, she said. Perhaps the trendsetter will be sitting across from Lee in the coming weeks to tell her side of the story. As more people are beginning to tune into Chrysian's interview on Jason Lee's podcast, some are finding that their perspective on the lit artist has changed. She not as dumb as y'all think, one viewer tweeted. She actually does hold herself accountable. I really pray she gets all the help she needs. Watching the interview got me in tears of joy, Chrysian Rock expressed on Twitter earlier this weekend. Like dang, God really can change or turn any situation. As long as you give it to him, he will turn your bad to your good. I'm actually proud of myself for pushing through, she added. Furthermore, she recently admitted to having a fight with Koi Larry over a failed collab and proximity to her then-boyfriend, Blueface, which resulted in Rock throwing her phone in Koi's face. According to what the Zeus Network darling said on the Jason Lee show in a new bombshell interview, the Massachusetts MC was being fake in her eyes. You guys had a history before, right? Yeah, because I'm genuine. Pretending there were no tensions between them. I yeah. thought she wanted to do a collab with some music, but really she was just... She didn't seem to want to go that far, but Rock had business to take care of. Really, she was just trying to out me out the plan and bag my nigga. I'm like, you can have him, I just want the verse. It's just we fell out because she wanted what she wanted. She had a hidden agenda when she hung out with me. Then, the Baltimore native claimed that she met the player's artist on a tour bus with Glow Rilla earlier this year while she was still pregnant. Koi Larry and everybody face, Chrissy and Rock added. Cause everybody know we don't really fuck with each other, and I'm pregnant. She know we not cool. You can ask anybody that was right there. Yeah, I took my phone, I get, I'll buy a new one. I threw that bitch in her face. What are you doing? She just wanna sit in my face and smile. I don't know what it was, but I ain't give a fuck what it was. I Meanwhile, this conversation ended up revealing a lot about one's current situation's mother. She explained many of the headlines, antics, developments, and major scandals that have defined her post-baby media space. Things have improved slightly, but it remains a contentious and difficult spectacle to navigate. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.